What is up guys, Wiggy here. I thought I would go ahead and make another video. Um, I've been getting into wrestling a little bit lately, the WWE. Uh, I was into it a lot when I was a kid, and I've been watching Botchamanias now on YouTube, and they are hilarious, and they're kind of getting me back into it. And I've been watching a lot of interviews and documentaries and just pipe bombs and everything I can on YouTube. And I'm going to have to go out on a limb here and take one big fat guess at the reason at why the WWE is declining horribly. And it is because of the fans. All right, I'm going to go ahead and explain some stuff here. I was a fan of wrestling back in the Attitude Area when Stone Cold Steve Austin was beating the crap out of McMahon. That was awesome. And then The Rock came in and The Rock blew it up. It was amazing. After that, I didn't believe it anymore. It was unrealistic. Kane take his mask off. Stone Cold started with the milk and the hugging and the guitar and Foley was gone. There was no more blood and you weren't allowed to cuss anymore. And it was just ridiculous. So I stopped watching completely. It was dumb. It was stupid. I wasn't going to support a fake product. Who supports a product that is ultimately trying to deceive you and take your money? Morons. I'm sorry, guys. If you are still sub subscribed to the WWE Network, if you still watch all three hours of Raw, if you still buy their shirts, if you still give them money if you still in any way support the wwe even though they straight out claim they do not care about you you're a moron i'm sorry like if you really want change from something you have to stand up you have to sacrifice you have to turn off the channel you have to stop giving money to the machine you have to stop trending them and twittering them and you have to just stop complaining all right you have to turn off the channel, switch it off, and give them a break. You have to, sh like, I just watched the video. I'll post the link here. It was why WWE doesn't care about their fans. They just had a record low of 2.95 million viewers, under 3 million viewers. That's a record low for them. But guess what? They're making more money now than ever before because all their products on the shop. It's the fans. You have to stop feeding them if you really want change, if you really want your uh wrestling icons you're, to really succeed you have to block out the McMahons and the Triple H's you have to stop giving them all of your views and your time and your energy you have to block them cut them out you, I really love CM Punk now I went back and I watched all of the stuff he was saying and oh my god if you watch him now it so rings true McMahon's standing there I don't give a damn what you people want. That's the problem, Vince. And we realize that. That's why we don't watch you. But if you're still going to give them money, then of course McMahon's still going to do his thing. Why are you going to break something that... Uh, break something? Why are you going to fix something that isn't broke? And he's still making money, so it's not broken to him. I'm just saying, guys, if you really want change from a product you really love, you have to sacrifice watching it for a while. Now, the sad thing is there's lots of YouTube channels I, I subscribe to, and they tell me on their channels they will never stop watching. That's part of the problem, too. When there is no ultimate low that can ever stop you from watching, then there's a fundamental problem with that. You're addicted to that product, and there's nothing that product will ever be able to do to sway you. I think that is a huge part of the problem. But there's nothing I can do about that. I'm telling you, if you guys really want to change from a product you really love, you have to cut it out of your life. You have to give them a break. You have to stand up and say, hey, this is unfair. We deserve better. We deserve the people we want to entertain us to be treated better. Then you really have to stand up for them and you have to stand up for yourself and say, I'm better than this. I deserve better than this. And ultimately have to just turn off the goddamn TV for a couple years. And that is my opinion on why I believe the wrestling fans are ultimately the worst thing for the WWE right now at this point. 
Well, if you guys uh, think I'm wrong, go ahead and let me know. If you guys think I'm right, like this video, subscribe. I'm going to try and do something a little bit different every time. If you haven't noticed, I did the Kenny hood this time. Uh, it's because I don't really have time to do the whole mouth gestures. So I'm going to try the Kenny thing. I can do other animations I'm going to try mess with. So look forward to more of that. Uh, yeah. Wiggy out. Take it sleazy. Peace.